doesn't feel safe. You bastard. You bastard. Wake up. Why did I not pack a little mega? Oh! Punch him in the face, pow! Get your damned hands off of me! What the hell? No. I didn't mean to hit start. I'm sorry. Wait, so was that an actual person or was I tripping? What is going on? What is happening? the hell wait is that is that who I think it is that's old boy with the messed up eye right why he looks so nasty now what what has happened where, where have I been what did I miss why, why is he all jacked up now Oh, Fliss. Fliss. Fliss is dead? How did Fliss die? Oh. Fam. What is going on? <sighs> Fam, come on. All right, so the little, my captain, my captain dude is dead or a zombie or something. We, we killed somebody that could have been a ghost, but wasn't a ghost or was helping us, but was trying to kill us. Fliss is, Dead? Conrad isn't talking to nobody? I, I don't know what's happening, bro. Whatever's wrong with him is not a good sign. It is too much going on. I don't like this. Who's playing the old creepy tan music, man? Oh, God. Why 
water purification. Cold? That doesn't seem right. Hold on, wait a minute. Shipper classified, carrier, U.S. Army, cosigner classified, cosigner, oh, cosignee, uh, Corporal Hicks, Origin Water Purification Plant, Maturia, Port of, oh, Port of Discharge, Harbor Market, Maturia, Port South China Sea, Port of Loading, Bernard's Point Naval Shipyard, San Francisco, USA, Maturian Gold, Quantity Unknown, Weight Unknown, Value Classified. The cosignee certifies that the items received have been inspected and are regarded as safe for transportation to the port of discharge stated. That's a lie. The items are not contraband and are legally allowed to enter the destination country in compliance with that country's customs laws. All items will be correctly stowed and labeled in accordance with the shipping vessel's own safety regulations and noted in cargo manifest for the shipping vessel in accordance with international cargo law. Signature, cosignee's name. I wonder if this was like an attack. Like if this, it says it was coming from, it was coming from South China, Manchuria, Manchuria port. So was it, uh, was it like, hey, we gonna give y'all some of our gold and for real, for real, they was like giving them a, a, a curse or something? I, I don't know. I don't know, man. I don't know. We're going to give them some uh, Manchurian gold. Yep, call it that. <laughs> it's barbecue sauce. Don't worry about it. Mm -mm. It's zombies and stuff. Conrad. I help him. Conrad. Come on, baby. Come mess with your boy. Okay. We gotta go back to the gym. What's this? Uh, let's see. Military police report. Mm. I was alerted by kitchen staff to investigate rowdy behavior on the mess deck at approximately 0105. Um, I arrived at the mess a moment later and found an excited crowd cheering and goading two men in the center. I dispersed the crowd and made my way through to investigate. Approaching the center of the crowd, I found PFC brand laying. Oh, is that private? Uh, no, that's not private. Uh, PFC. Well, anyway, brand laying on the ground with blood on his face and clothing. And I believe that's private. Wagner standing over him with bloodied fist. As I approached the two men, Wagner turned towards me and attempted to attack me to attack myself and brand some members of the crowd assisted me in restraining wagner and i arrested him at the scene he is currently in custody of sergeant wood at pto all right okay uh, we can go in here oh we got another letter pick it up Well, it's your turn to have dinner with William tonight. I feel for him. Last night he got drunk, again, and just kept talking about his wife. Poor sod. He's taking it all on himself. It's difficult, but I think he needs his senior officers around him right now. Okay for 8 p.m.? Regards, Tom. Blank. <laughs> all right. Um, We're going to keep it pushing. I know I missed one room back there, but I feel like since that was the room that was closest to Conrad, it'll send me on like a mission or something. So I decided to come down here. Come down here first. Mm. I don't like how we have so many options. Must be the captain and his poor wife. Sheesh. All right. I need a key. There's got to be a key around here somewhere. Mm, we're not going to open that door. 
Why would we do that? Oh, I guess that's what we do gotta do. Okay, you know what I'm saying? Recognize for your hard work and all that. <laughs> we got a key. Let's go. It's a door right there, but I'm afraid to go through it. I'm always afraid to go through things and it end up being more of the mission and I don't get to explore everything. Hold it. A shipment of unstable chemicals. Man, you ain't gonna read that? Read the paper, dog. Come on now, Brad. Uh, summary of Manchurian Gold Test 6. I believe that's what that is. Property of U.S. Science Corps. Study of response of human beings to ingested chemical... Designate Manchurian Gold. Chemical ingested in crystal dust form by subjects A, B, C, D, and E. They had these people smoking dust? They were smoking. No wonder they went crazy. They were on that dust, man. All volunteers provided by base sergeant. Man, they had them on them drugs. Test successful. Re results consistent with biological specimen test reports in supplied files. Full report forthcoming. Further study strongly recommend recommended of stimulus response relationship in subjects under influence of chemical. Please note, latest test results do not supersede results of Manchurian Gold Test 4 and Manchurian Gold Test 5. High caution must be taken to avoid exposure of chemical to solution, extreme heat, and electricity. Oh, snap. All right. So the Manchurian Gold actually wasn't gold. It was a chemical that they had in those boxes or coffins. And it got hit by the freaking lightning bolt. And I guess it, it started to do its its thing. Damn. Damn. That Manchurian gold got the people going, man. <laughs> got the streets in a frenzy. Huh? Y'all thought crack did something. You ever had Manchurian gold, baby? Wait a minute. Pull yourself together, man. Hey, it's me. It's Brad. Be reassuring. Oh God. Oh God. Well, no going back there. Comrade! Ooh, my thumb's too big or something. Hey, Conrad, bruh, come on, fam. I know you're on that dust right now, but come on. Let me in! Come on! Damn, Brad, I feel for you, baby. These little quick time events blowing me. Come on, Khan. Hey, stop. Come on, man, stop. Dude, you gotta stop. It's crazy. 
Oh boy. I can't scratch my nose or nothing. Oh. Knees weak, arms are sweaty, palms spaghetti, mom's chaffetti. No, no, no. Come on, bro. Fliss already dead, bro. We don't need somebody else to die. Stop walking closer, Brad. What the hell? Uh, get away from the edge, Conrad. It's okay. Get the flashlight out of his face. Yes, let's go. Come on, baby. Let's go, baby. Come on, man. Oh, man. You got to stop eating strangers' booty, man. Now you got the lip, lip, the little lip, 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 lip. <laughs> well, you got a full body, blip, 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 blip. He's here. We didn't kill Danny. Oh, we did kill Danny. That was Danny. I didn't know. Oh, snap the dude, the curator. Um, run, run, run. <clears throat> Why did they split up? Oh! Right, shut up. We running. Get off me, hoe. Bang! On. Uh. Yeah. What's happening? Come on. We gotta get somewhere safe. Dang, man, my girl Fliss, dog. My girl Fliss. I gotta pause, man. I need, I need, I need to drink my water. I, I need a swig. I need a swig, bro. I, I need a swig, cause man. Mm, mm, mm. Okay. We back at it. We back at it. Look back at it. Look back at it. All right. Oh my God. Oh, hello. Things appear to have taken a turn towards the spiritual, wouldn't you say? Now you're another one, Dad. And has anyone seen Fliss? 
Have you figured out what's going on? How to stop them? How to save the lives of your poor, unfortunate stowaways? You will, I hope. Although it seems the ship's previous occupants never managed to. Quite a lot of deaths that night. Let me help you out. Give you a little hint. Um, I need some help or I don't want spoilers. Yeah, let's let's keep it that way. We did that the first option. Let's let's keep it that way. We don't want no spoilers, man. No hint. Perhaps you think you can piece things together from the clues you found yourself. Good luck with that. Perhaps you've started to realize something. That everything and everyone may not be quite what they appear to be. I hope that helps. Well, aren't you excited to find out what your poor unfortunates are making of all this and how you might avoid any more unnecessary tragedy? Go on, back to it. Speak soon. Okay.